Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel TNArt. Today we will be seeing that how many type of holographic sheets are there. So this is a rainbow film, window film and this is diffraction greeting sheet. And this mold is made out of diffraction greeting sheet. This flower one. And I have a tutorial available for this and I will be linking it into the description. And this is made from the rainbow window film. This is the one you have seen it already so many times. Let's start. So we will be seeing that what are the results and what are the differences between these molds. This is the diffraction greeting sheet. And now let's start. Let's start with mixing the resin and the resin I will be using here is Violet's resin. It's one to one ratio resin and really easy to mix. So I'm mixing part A and B equally after adding both parts i will be mixing it really slowly because i don't want more bubbles into my resin so this will take some time and I do mix my resin around for 5 minutes all until it's all clear. And after when I'm done mixing, I will be taking these two tints. These are transparent pigments. One is violet and one is black. Dividing my resin into two parts. And I will be adding black pigment into my resin little by little because I want it to be too transparent, not that black, jet black, if you can understand me. I think this is the right color. Again, I'm adding the tint to my resin really slowly because this can also introduce bubbles. So you have to work patiently with resin. So this is the first layer. I am adding it to the mold. And now on to with the violet purple shade. Again, I will be adding very little to my resin because I don't want this strong purple color. And now I am pouring into the mold. So when I was making these, I wanted to make them a bit fun and not really simple. So what I did here is I just decided to add different elements to these. For the first one, for my heart mold, I will be using, first of all, I will be removing the bubbles that are still inside the resin with the heat gun. As I was discussing that I will be adding some elements to these so I will be adding this Trissy silicone mold to the heart 
and again the tutorial for this will be linked in my description and above as well and for the other flower i will be topping it with this holographic mold again so both of these have holographic effects so let's see how it turned out fingers crossed so this is the next day and let's see i did a little peek on this black one you can see because i was impatient but i didn't demold it so we will be molding it all together and that drizzy effect never disappoints me it turns out so beautiful and you can see how shiny it is so now we demold the original heart and let's see how the holographic has been transferred here you go and it still look really beautiful and i've i have been asked on this tutorial that how many time have i have been using this heart mold and you i don't know i even even forgot the count how many time have, i have used it so it's still going and now it's time to demold the flower so i can see i got some overspill and i get a circular flower here but don't worry we will clean it up the hollow has been transferred really beautifully and let's demold the flower now so you can see the difference in the diffraction uh, in the holographic effect that with the diffraction grating sheet the effect of the holographic is really different and with it with the rainbow film it's really different so this is the result with the sunlight and this is the rainbow film both of them are equally beautiful and they give really different effects i love both of them and again with this drizzy it's like a cherry on top so this is the quick video on both sheets that they have different results but they are really beautiful you can try both of them and i will link the videos in my description so if you did like the video please do like subscribe and share thumbs up if you like the video and thank you so much for watching take care Bye-bye.